guys and welcome to today's plan with me. Um, I'm going to be doing a, uh, a weekly wellness spread in my wellness extension pack. And as you can tell, uh, we are definitely into um, fall right now, which is my absolute favorite season. And I'm really excited to do this spread too because it is my birthday week so I'm like super pumped for this and it's funny because I've been like literally hoarding stickers just for this spread um for this week and I'm loving the fact that I have this minty green color in my wellness pack and it just I don't know it just screams fall to me so we're gonna go ahead and get started here uh, first thing that I do is I remove the sheets just because it's a lot easier to work with. So let's get that out of the way. And let's see here. Let's get these back into view for you. So for today's layout, I'm going to be using some washi that I got from the Recollections foil pack. Um, some stickers from the little mini pad, the lovely pastels, just because I thought that they were adorable and they do go well with this minty green. Um, I'm also going to be using stickers from the Wellness Happy Planner pack. And... Just because it is my birthday, I am going to be using a couple of the balloons. Well, actually not really a couple. I'm just going to be using one. But there's a balloon sticker I'm going to be using from the Happy Illustrations. And I do pre-select all my stickers just so that I don't have to sit here and bore you to death with um, picking them out. <laughs> so I go ahead and I basically have everything I'm going to use on an old uh, used up sticker sheet. Just makes planning a lot easier. Now the first thing that I am going to start with here is since my washi tape is see-through, I'm going to go ahead and just wipe this part out up here first. And I do that with some uh, old, well, I guess it's not old, just uh, just an empty strip of um, your basic white label sticker paper. So let's go ahead and cut that into a strip, which if you are a frequent viewer of my YouTube channel, you will know that I normally do not have, um, I don't even know what the correct term is here, but uh, uh, manicured nails, I guess. I typically do a uh, masculine style job, so nails really aren't in uh, my typical routine. So if you see me struggling here, it's because I am really not used to having fingernails. But since it's my birthday week, I wanted my nails to look gorgeous. And so we're just gonna have to bear through the struggle here. So, all right, start by covering up any of the wording. And I'm going to try to slice that. All right, so we got one side done. Now for the other side. And when you're doing this, you don't have to be like perfectly straight with it just for the fact that you're going to be covering it up with other stickers. I just try to do this as a quick way of waiting out what I don't want. 
I've seen a lot of other people use um, white out or even white gel pens and I have tried that and it just didn't work for me. It just left this big goo on my page and it just, I don't know that I couldn't get the stickers to lay right on it. So this method seems to work the best for me. I don't know. Maybe whiteout works great for you. If you do have a favorite white gel pen or, you know, whiting out technique, please share it down below in the comments. I'd really like to see what yins are doing and what works for you. Maybe I could give it a try too. So, okay. We got that all whited out. It's not that I don't like the uh, thankful for or focusing on sections. It's just not really what I want for this week. So, what are we going to start with next? Okay, so one thing I am going to do first here is I'm going to go ahead and just take my washi Here, I want to strip probably about that long. Just go ahead and lay this down. Now, some of this is going to get covered up, some of it's going to see through. This is there, we go. That looks a lot better. Then seeing those words peeking through underneath. So I'll just trim the sides up like this. That's the other good thing about having that sticker sheet off to the side is when you get trimmings like this, you can you you know you have somewhere to throw them off to. Instead of having a whole bunch of sticker trimmings laying everywhere. This makes planning a lot neater. Alright, let's get this guy laid down. I really love this washi pack that I got. I got it on a really good sale deal too. I think it was like 20 bucks for the whole tube and I only ended up paying like eight bucks so I don't know maybe that's why I like it so much but it does go well with the wellness sticker pack I mean you can't go wrong with rose gold either okay there we go. Got a nice pretty border there. Already starting to shine it up some. Now I do have plans with my sister. I don't know if I want to go above this. No, I'm just going to go right over it like I normally do. So we... I've planned maybe a little bit lower. We got plans to go see a local battlefield reenactment for this weekend. So I figured I would put that there. And I found this cute little travel location sticker out of the wellness pack and I figure I'm gonna cover up this heart here just so that I can remember the location that we're gonna be visiting that weekend so I got that and then I'm gonna use this whole cube up here um, 
another thing that I was wanting to see if it would work out is I'm going to go ahead and take this border here and I'm going to see if I can use it to line this box up. So this, this should be interesting since I don't have full dexterity. But I believe this was originally one of those larger uh, notes, kind of like this one, just in a seafoam green color. I used it in a previous spread. Never let any of your stickers go to waste. Try to use up everything you got in your packs. Now if I could get the thing off the paper. Oh, my ladies with nails, how do you do it? Need to like hashtag you all and call you super women. Let's see here, tweezers. Because I am brutally killing this thing. Poor sticker border never stood a chance. Alright, we think this out. Maybe it's best if I start down in the corner and work my way up. I promise you guys, this is going to look good when we're done. Okay, so as you can see, this is just a little bit wider than what I originally wanted. So, I'm going to go ahead, snip this guy right there. And then we're going to lay this right on top and try to cover up that line. There we go. All right, continue making that border. Okay, now this part up here we no longer need. Again, we're going to trim it, again, trim this side, there we go, okay, I'm going to save that, I might want that for something else in this spread, okay. There we go. Got another sticker sheet. Okay, now again, this is my birthday. Don't know if I want him going straight. Let's see what we're going to put in this corner here. Because I do want to leave room for writing. Let's see here, this is happy day. You see what I mean about these stickers? Just matching this green color. I just couldn't believe that it was like seriously the same minty green color and it's not even from the same pack or theme. I was just like, oh, you know, 
don't know if any of you get that same same feeling there I know I do so let's see here start adding some color now one thing I do try to do is I never put the same color sticker beside a border if I do end up getting the border let's see here we'll stick this one up here All right, and I am going to end up trimming this off because I'm going to lay a, let's see here, we'll start with a, uh, we'll do a reflections first. So, go ahead. Did we even cut? There's my cut. Lost where my cut was. A shimmery gold. Okay, got that one lined up. I'm going to keep this edge lifted just a bit, and then that's going to help me add just another snippet of this. It's this one I'm going to end up trimming by hand. There we go. This is another great way to uh, get those backgrounds type stickers to spread out farther. Let's see here, maybe I want gold to stick out on the end because I believe my box, the next box I'm going to use is a minty color too. Okay down on that and because What do I want to go with next? <laughs> I always end up pulling so many stickers and it's like, what, what do, where do we go from? Okay, maybe I just might leave, no, no I'm not going to leave that. We are going to go with a today wash. Right. Okay, now this day is this the day that I have? Yes, I do. Okay, so this is a special day here. Hmm. And I am going to pick a different color box here because I don't want to do the same boxes. So maybe starting right there. I like to leave some of these open so that I can jot down some notes. So let's go ahead and have this. Let's see here. We'll do some of the pinks. Stick this one on top. Color 
right about there. And I'm lay down. This guy's a little fuzzy on the end. Trim off the fuzz. I love those special day stickers. Let's see here, we'll spread that color just a little bit more down below. I feel like that is crooked as all get out. Why are we crooked? Is it the special day sticker that's crooked? It's my bars. Definitely my bars. Getting that color on there. It's how I'm standing. Actually, I think it might be the way that I cut that. I'm going to slice it just a little sliver. Okay, that looks a bit better to me. Alright, so I have a special day, daily reflection, um, another thing I was wanting to head on, okay, again, okay, this one is my birthday, I do want to add my balloon, I think I might have it going a little to the side. We'll stick them there just like that. Then that way I have some writing space down there. And of course my happy birthday. I think I really need Saturday. I know it's going to be Saturday, so stick that guy on there like that. Okay. Now, let's see here. I want to add a bit more color up there. Hmm. here I do need to add something down here I feel like this is kind of naked another daily highlights maybe That's what I can do. Okay, so again, I'm just going to try to snip this as straight as possible. And get this lined up with that border. Sticker scrapping, sticking to me everywhere. Okay, start working this one up. And 
don't get an aid. That right about there. There we go. I don't know what it is, but it's just like I love this little cutout. I think it's cute. But it just drives me absolutely insane if I just see a white block behind that corner. So that's that's why I do the layering. And it is kind of nice because it helps you add color to your spread. So just in case if you're wondering why this lady keeps doing what she's doing, this is why. Okay, I loved this sticker. I thought it was adorable. Try to do that because there's just something about that that's driving me nuts. But that is a special day and I need that sticker there. So, should I try to color block this? Maybe add some me time, but then again, this guy right here is naked. Gotta add something there, too. So, let's see. I still have this left. So I can drag this down, make a me time block down here. I'm going to need to make sure that I have enough to cover that. What can I add? Maybe I'll just leave that just like that. Alright, so I need a me time block. Hmm. See there guys, adding color, adding things that we could journal to. And I'm sorry I'm not like speaking, oh, oh, here comes my cat. This is Bird everybody. Uh, it drives him absolutely insane when I plan because I'm not paying attention to him. And he probably wants his chair. So, there we go. Alright, Bird's out of the picture. <laughs> Oh, you gotta love your cat. Okay. So, we have a daily gratitude, and I do have a treat myself sticker still. So, let's see here. One, two, so that would leave this one. So, I'll go ahead and put my daily gratitude here. And... Since this is a special day, might as well leave my treat myself here too. Alright. It's coming along nicely. I'm actually liking it. It's a lot different than what I typically do. Now to keep up with this confetti thing here, I did take these from the Happy Illustrations as well. And to spread them around, I'm just going to snip them like this. And I'm just going to add them. Just like so. To my corners. Do not that corner. That is my box. I want that for writing. Add that down there. Let's see here, guys. What do you think? Just two long strips across the top? Just to add a little bit more fun. Let's 
see here, these are both short. I'll add that there. Line this one up there. I'm going to trim off a little bit of the excess. Actually, might do the same thing down here. Oh, sticker waste. Always get those little slivers stuck to me and I can't get them off. There we go. Actually, I think I might, instead of making these borders, I think I'm going to cut them a little bit more in half and turn them into corners. If I can get them back off the page. Circles are real, guys. It's real. Okay. Spread that confetti, right? We'll spread it. Okay, let's see how this looks. Alright, so there we go. We've got some confetti pouring from there. Gonna have a little confetti there. Let's try to get this guy off without ripping everything else off. It's a lot easier with uh, square shape stickers. Help if I'm right in the in the right square, huh? Oops. All right, in this last little guy, we put in right there. All right. Now, do I want to trim? This. Yes, I do. If I didn't, I wouldn't have noticed it. So, if you're ever in doubt about doing something, go with your gut feeling. If you noticed it, it's because you want it changed. Alright, guys. I'm digging this layout. This is definitely, yes, this is exactly what I envisioned and a little bit more and i absolutely love it it's all bright and colorful it matches my theme and yeah this is definitely a lot different than what i normally do in my wellness planner but i am absolutely digging it so uh i just want to wish you all a uh very happy and um healthy week and I will see you for my next plan with me. Have a wonderful week. And again, enjoy, guys. And thank you for watching.